again doing JavaScript algos and data structures on free code camp. We're in basic JavaScript on challenge 68 of 113. So today we are going to be using comparison with the less than or equal operator. This is just like the greater than or equal operator if you saw that video. Um, literally it's just comparing values saying is this value less than or equal to 5? That's true because it's less than. Is 7 less than or equal to 7? That's true because it is equal to. Uh, and note that this is in a string, so it will convert data types, okay? So it'll attempt to at least. Is three less than or equal to two? That's false, so it'll return false. So we're just gonna take the less than or equal to operator to the indicated line so that the return statements make sense. So we have a function, we take in a value, and we're checking if the value, and then return smaller than or equal to 12. Same thing, taking in a value, checking if val, returning smaller than or equal to 24, and then if none of these conditions hit, meaning none of these conditional statements, we conditional checks we implement here uh, are true, then we are just simply gonna return more than 25. So we wanna check if a value is smaller than or equal to 12. So we can say if val less than or equal to 12, then that will hit if it's 12 or under. If it's not 12 or under, it'll go to this check and say, is it less than or equal to, these have to be next to each other, 24. If that is true, if it is 24 or under, um, it will hit this. And then if neither of those conditions hit, that means it is not less than 12 and not less than 24. So it is more than 24 and it will return that statement. And that's all we had to do for this one. I hope to see you guys in the next lesson.